how you doing uh wanted to make a quick video this is not gonna be too long i don't think but i got a couple of points that i want to make about our past uh one of the points being that you know i know you know i've i've talked about in videos before about how past your past does matter you know whether you deny your past or not it does matter and, and always remember that people that you hadn't seen or you don't see very often say you hadn't seen certain people in 30 years when you see them the next time other than looking older other than them looking older they're going to think of you in the same way they remember you from 30 years ago. You're still that same person to them. Okay? You're still that same person to them. Uh, so, till they understand and see how you are, that's the way they're going to treat you, just like they always have. Except for, you know, you're older and, and, and all that. Uh, hopefully, have more respect for each other and stuff like that. That's one aspect of it. Another aspect of it is that what doesn't make sense is how people talk about, well, my past, that's the past, so it doesn't matter. Well, in your future trajectory, it really shouldn't matter. You should be growing from that, learning from your mistakes and growing from that. I agree with that. But why do so many people, so many people, so many people want to lie about their past? If it doesn't matter, and you're getting beyond that, why are you lying about it? Do, can we understand that just a little bit? Why are you lying about it? Why are you telling untruths about it if it really doesn't matter. Can you explain that to me? That's what doesn't make sense. People act like it doesn't matter. People, you know, oh, well, that don't matter. It's my past. It doesn't matter. That's right. So why are you, one thing, if it doesn't matter, why are you denying it? Another thing, why are you lying about it? Why are you not being honest about it? Why are you not trying to get on past it? trying to move from it and learn from it and go on. You see, what other people find out about your past, they didn't know to begin with, so it's new to them. So it's not really past. They find out new things about you from your past. You see what I'm saying? If you've lied to them before about it, then they find out you've lied. That's something new, so it does matter. That does matter. Whether you say it does or not, it does. Uh, that's why, you know, it makes no sense to me how people act like, well, you know, it doesn't matter. You shouldn't say anything about that. You shouldn't bring that up. You shouldn't hold that against me. Nobody says they hold it against you. I hold against somebody if they're lying to me that's what i hold against somebody i know we all make mistakes i know we've done stuff that we regret i know we do we do stuff we've done stuff that we wish we had never done it was mistakes but i own those mistakes and i live beyond and i've learned from them but i don't lie about them you see, we forget, lying is an abomination of God. And so many people think lying is just something simple and doesn't matter. But it's the word says it's an abomination. Uh, you know, it's this whole world, this whole society is just comfortable with lies. I mean, they're comfortable with lies. It doesn't bother them. Lies are good to them. I mean, I don't like the situation. I'm going to lie about it. I, I, I don't want you to know about my past. I'm going to lie about it. 
It doesn't matter. I'm just lying. It's only lying. Really. You know, I know a lot of people that claim to have the Holy Ghost. Some of you don't understand the Holy Ghost that might be watching this, which I doubt there is. If somebody doesn't understand about it, it's the infilling of the Spirit of God. It's having the Spirit of God in you. If you claim to have the Holy Ghost, you kept claim to be saved of God, how can you go through life telling lies about your past, telling lies at all, and claim to be a child of God? How, how, is, that, how is that so? You cannot claim to be a child of God and be a liar. That is living a life of sin. It is an abomination of God. To claim you're a Christian yet lie about anything to do with your past or it doesn't bother you to lie. How can you claim to be a child of God if you're a liar? So many people just think nothing about lying. And I trust me, I'm in a, I have a job that people probably lie to me all the time. It's every day's business, just about. Uh, so I know. And you know, especially if it's somebody close to you. People just need to realize what the Word of God says about lying. Turn from it and tell the truth.